Okay, I'm standing out in front of D2F. And so you can see how close it is to the slopes. If you ski down here, you'll end up in the, in the, in the living room, which is right there. Got a little grassy area out here. And these, these right here, uh, the retaining walls, are actually going to be replaced this spring with uh, natural boulders. So um, a little nicer landscaping. But as you can see right up there is the pool so you just it's a quick short walk there you know good all day sun and quick access to the slopes so we're gonna go in this is Sully Sully is my neighbor's dog hi Sully he's just hanging out in here we're barking come here Sully come here Sully don't be silly okay so we're in inside D2F we got the kitchen here these are all pretty much the same layouts, but you know, as you can see from the pictures, they got the big couch and they got the little boot warmers here. Yeah, it's all. And then you got uh, it's a gas fireplace over here, and then of course, it's nice when you sit down on the on the couch with Solly. You got a pretty good view of the mountain. You can see the Cirque. Um, obviously, it's quick, easy. Um, quick and easy to let your dog out. So, I'll just kind of pan around this way. And so, yeah, they got some pretty cool. These are all new appliances the chill, the big chill, and uh, they put in a Whirlpool dishwasher, uh, Frigidaire uh, stove, and microwave. And then they do have, you know, the same thing, the, the vanity out here, but this could be turned into um, the washer and dryer. Because, you know, obviously right next door, you got the, the bathroom, the shower, but in this closet, they got a full, I mean, it's like brand new washer dryer. So I don't know if their intention was to put it in over there, but this is a pretty big closet. Let me turn the light. There we go. They got all their ski stuff. I mean, it's pretty deep um, as an owner's storage. So you would just put all your stuff in here, lock it up um, for when you rent it out, and move the washer and dryer and close it over here. And then, of course, you got the bedroom here. Uh, it's pretty nice views. So you got your uh, flat screen dresser I'm just gonna walk over here so you can see the closet over there so I will walk back out and walk to the front desk just so you can see the distance between here and the front desk you saw how close the pool was and then from the front desk I'll walk up to A2G and then we'll go take a look at that one next okay like I said I'm outside of uh, D2F. Now we're going to walk to the lobby. You can kind of see the pool up there. and Of course in the summer you can walk out this direction and, and down the hill. and That's where the concerts are, right around the corner. So pretty convenient um, to go there. But, so anyway. Here it is again, right down there. Go this way. You got the parking area right out there. And then here's the front entry to the lobby. So we'll grab a code and go up to A2G. Okay, I'm out in front of the lobby. I got my code. So we're going to walk up to A2G. Just give you a sense of, I guess, the difference in, di in uh, distance. So I'll take a little detour over here. So D2F, you're going to walk up, you know, the hill there, and there's a back entry 
to the pool. And from A2G, you walk down and come to the pool that way. So you got a little fire pit, you got your hot tubs, your pool right next to the slopes. So, so D2F's a little closer to the pool. I don't know if that's important or not. This way. So this is a pretty cool little spot in the winter and the summer. They got outdoor furniture, fire pit, they got two gas grills, and then they got your ski storage over there or right here. So you don't have to lug your skis all the way back to the condo. Of course with D2F you can ski right to it, so you probably would do that, but for A2G you'd probably leave it out here. grills everywhere. So with all these along the top part here, you, know, you just ski in right off a fanny hill and people cut a path just along here. So you might ski right back to A2G and leave your skis right outside or at least to the stairs. Snowman or snow woman. Another grill. You can also walk down those stairs right there as opposed to the way we came up and that'll get you back down to the lobby too. here at A2G, which is that unit right there. Again, these tie rails right here are going to be replaced this spring with boulders and they're going to, you know, so it'll be a little prettier. A um, little tighter quarters, you know, between the, the porch and the tie rails. D2F's a little set back so you got a little bit more yard there. And of course you can see the slope down there. So I'm going to go inside and turn on the lights and uh, see where we go from there. Okay, I'm inside A2G. Uh, it's kind of a flip-flop of D2F. Um, but you got, you know, kind of the same kitchen configuration. Right here, they got uh, granite countertops. Um, I mean, nice appliances. You know, not the upgraded stainless steel, but still not bad. Um, I'm trying to think. A little closet there, which I don't know if there's. Let's look. It's just a coat closet. And living room. This one's furnished a little bit more for adults than just one giant big couch. <laughs> so, um, here's your view from here. Here. So it does face south. It doesn't get quite as much sun because of the buildings and the trees, but still, you're getting you know natural daylight. It's a very similar gas fireplace there. Got the and then up there, TV. All these come fully furnished as well. One thing I did notice in the difference is that this this is smaller. I don't know why that one is so much wider. Maybe they expanded the kitchen. I'm not sure, but this is definitely smaller. And then you get your bathroom over here. Uh, not quite as upgraded 
And then here's the storage or owner's closet, which we know how big that is from being in the other one, but this one's locked. And then the bedroom. Similar. The guests checked out of here, so they're still in the process of making the beds, but um, closet over there. You got the dresser with your TV. So that's uh, it's not too big a place, so it doesn't take too long to video. But this is A to G. And I believe this one was they're gonna ask four twenty four is their ask price. So um, they were listed at 420, but I think they put in some new carpet. They may have done some upgrades to the furnishings. So anyway, I will get this off to you and then hope to see you in a few weeks.